is it better to let the roots decay slowly or should you till them up to speed up that process? You know, it depends on what your goal is. And I know there's people that strongly believe one way or the other. I think I'm much more open-minded about this. Now, personally, I like to leave root systems intact as much as I can because that's a there's a better chance that that's going to turn into a slow decay of the residue, which is going to eventually turn a portion of that into humus. And that's what I want. I want to build my organic matter in my soil. But by the same token, I've got to plant a crop this year. I've got to have it be successful. And if I've got a ton of residue out in the field, I may need to do some tillage in one way or another to kind of get that out of the way and break it up. Uh, so I, I understand the, the intention of, hey, let's break some of this down. The other thing about doing that tillage and releasing those nutrients from the residue sooner, well, that can be a good thing too because that could help feed the next crop where if you just let it slowly decay, um, you're going to get a little bit of a carbon dioxide release off it, which is going to be great for the plants, but yeah, you're not going to get too many nutrients off it, letting it break down slowly. So there's kind of a trade-off each way. 